Well, hello and welcome to another episode of Radar Roast, my rig. I'm your host, Fluff. If you'd like to see your own rig on the show, I will link down below in the description to send her on in. And with that, let's get to the roasting, shall we? What a weird merging of old and new. First, we got an Axe FX2, which, you know, is a modern digital thing. And then we have a a mid 70s Electra Les Paul, which is actually fairly rare and a lot of mojo there. Um, I am a big fan of the Electrica, uh, Electra Les Pauls, excuse me. Looks like it has probably has a DiMarzio Super Distortion in it and your cable management is atrocious, whoever you are. Mm. And you're in some kind of a weird empty room I don't know where you're plugged in at, maybe a PA that I, we can't see. I'm not sure. However, I love that Les Paul. I like your pedal board. I like the fact that you have the controller. Uh, that's cool. Oh God, the cables just bug me. Um, I'm gonna give your rig, I'm gonna give your rig three and a half out of five beards. <laughs> Tell me you play country without telling me you play country. Um, you have uh, a, a beautiful assortment of guitars. A couple of Les Pauls, SG 335. You have a really cool Anderson um, Jaguar. You have uh, some Strat, you know, Strat Tele Firebird stuff. You have a bunch of third power amplifiers. Um, you like nice, crisp, clean, to crisp, clean tones. Mm hmm. Cool photo, though. And, uh, and you like a little bourbon as well. Your boy likes a little bourbon as well. As well. Captor X to uh, keep it quiet when needed. Um, tidy pedal board. I mean, honestly, solid rig. Whoever you are, solid rig. Man. Yeah, that's a real solid rig. You know what? Four and a half out of five beards. You earned it. Woo! Yeah. This is what I'm talking about. See, the PRS says, hello, how you doing? The Archon into the Orange 412 says, go away. I don't want to talk to you anymore because I'm going to be loud and I'm going to make you deaf. Probably kill, uh, probably kill some uh, small animals with volume. Pedal board, very, very tidy drop pedal so you like getting a little heavy you have the uh duncan 805 overdrive great overdrive uh noise clamp a hall of fame reverb tuner i mean it's all there it's all there cable management tidy i love that prs though i don't even know what color that is but mm. mm-hmm mm-hmm i like it it looks like you're uh in the lobby of like a uh, really nice hotel or something like the entrance, because that thing on the left, uh, the pillar on the left. But I'm gonna I'm gonna give you a rig four to five beards. <laughs> when credit cards go too far. So you clearly love the experience of going into a music store and being able to feel like you can just grab whatever, and you've recreated that experience at home. Now I like the lighting. Slightly cheesy, but it's it's fine. Your selection of guitars is is pretty damn good, to be honest. Also, what is this white reverse headstock 335 thing? Is that the Dwight Yoakam Epiphone thing? That's not that guitar, is it? Uh, you have uh, some strats. You have some Gibbies. You have a couple of balls. You have uh, some SGs. You have a Fender Twin. You have two Fender Twins. I mean, it's all here. You have a nice little comfy chair. You have a couple of little nice comfy chairs. Clearly you're jamming with somebody it looks like, but it's a vibe. I like vibe. I like the vibe. It's very nice. Also, not a bunch of cables everywhere. I appreciate that as well. I'm gonna have to give your rig four to five beards. <laughs> All right, so 
you probably drink a lot of booze. You probably wear a jean jacket as your main attire. Uh, you probably prefer Marbreds. That's a cigarette. And you probably hate the Black Album. You do. It's okay. You feel how you feel. Uh, great setup. This is a vibe. I don't know why the big mirror. I wouldn't want a mirror. But that's just me. But, you know, you have to... You have to kiss the guns in, in your own reflection here every once in a while, right? You got a lot of cool, uh, cool show posters and such. A lot of, a lot of flair. A little wall flair. Got uh, some cool dime guitars. You got the dime cab. You have uh, the angle amp, the EVH with the Marshall cab. Some Jacksons. You got uh, Jerry James Nichols uh, Epiphone. Uh, you have. Looks like you have an EVH Stealth Special or something. Um, electronic drum kit in the reflection. I mean, you got a lot of stuff. And it's a jam room and it's a vibe and. Got an Infowars.com sticker. E, that didn't age well. And um, I back this rig though. The rig's good. Big Pantera fan. I'm a big Pantera fan. I'm going to go ahead and give you a rig. I'm going to give this rig three and a half out of five beards. <laughs> so you literally took your entire apartment and you made it into a control room, it looks like. This looks like an apartment, because you can see the door on the on the far right, all the way back, on the, on the rear right. And you come in, there's the kitchen, much like I have here, except I'm not in an apartment, I'm in a house. And then you have your couches, basically you have a control room. You've made your entire apartment a control room. Respect, dude, respect, and I'm gonna say dude. I'm not gonna assume your identity, however. I'm gonna say dude, because no chick would ever do this, I don't think. Or no chick would ever let her dude do this. So single dude. I love it. It's awesome. <laughs> Can I come over? You have your friends over, you're like, hey, grab a guitar, plug into something, sit down on the couch. You have uh, you have an Ernie Ball Music Band access, yeah. Or is that a Van, that's actually a Van Halen one, I believe. Okay. Got a Les Paul Custom. You got a Strat in the back there. A bunch of EV8 stuff. A bunch of boogie stuff. Looks like you probably uh, you probably make a lot of music here and just vibe out. Good picture. I love this rig. Uh, I mean, this entire setup is really really cool. Four and a half out of five beards. Hey, we got the, uh, we got what I call an Ikea setup. This setup is to accentuate the rug and the trunk that is on sale. You can buy it at Ikea. It's probably called something that I can't even pronounce, uh, as is the table. And this is the metal head display that as you're walking by past the, the, the children's room display, this is the, uh, this is the metal heads display at Ikea. Little, uh, little ESP E2. Looks like Jeff from Parkway Drive signature guitar. Or that it could be. A uh, little homemade pedal board action. Got a couple of pedals. I love how well the Mesa Boogie 212 fits on that trunk. You got the Angle Fireball 25. Little plant next to the next to the radiator. And a little, uh, little interface and some headphones. And a nice little movie poster. Your cable man is a bit is all right. I'm still going to give you a rig three and a half out of five beers though. And last but not least, we have a submission from a discord server. If you want to come and hang out over on discord, I will link down below in the description and good God. Do you like Marshall? How do you feel about Marshall's? Dude. I mean, you like Marshalls. When you see something you like, you just dive right in, don't you? You got three GCM 900s. You have, what, four, five 800s, a bunch of Plexis, a whole bunch of JVMs, a whole bunch of EL34 power amps, um, or uh, JMPs, excuse me, 
JMP ones. Um, you 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 got you got all the damn Marshall heads in uh, in North America, guy. I mean, jeez. This also makes me feel better about my setup. So thank you. Um, <laughs> I don't care about the uh, the cases or the uh, the case caps up on top of the. You know what? I don't even care. No dog or not. This is straight up five out of five beers for me. And that does it for this episode of Rate or Roast My Rig. If you have your own rig that you would like to see rated and or roasted, I will link down below in the description to send it on over. And with that, you've been wonderful. I've been Fluff. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time.